your steps post distro install for Arch is wholly different, right? Yeah, well, it's a lot of um, it's a lot of getting the things you need instead of removing the things you don't. Yeah, but then that that's part of the installation process <laughs> when it comes to Arch, right? Ah, uh, yeah. Unless um, it's it's sort of like when we were talking about uh, landing on Saturn or landing on Jupiter. Mm-hmm. Like, does Jupiter and Saturn being gas giants? Like, do they have a surface? <laughs> <laughs> like, you don't know where with Arch, you don't know where the installation ends and the customization begins. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Arch is a gas giant. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, like, you know, the best scientists have to come up with like an arbitrary point in Jupiter and Saturn. Uh, this is the where surface, the yeah. surface begins, um, which is like the same amount of pressure as the surface of Earth mm-hmm. or sea level at Earth or something like that. Even though it's still sort of gassy, even though <laughs> even though you can just sort like, of oh. gassy. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly. Yeah, sort of gassy. Even if, even though you can go straight <laughs> through it, the quote-unquote surface of a gas giant is where the pressure is the same as the surface on Earth. Again, very, uh, what's it, centric. Very, what's the term that space people use? Earth-centric. There's a, Okay, because ethnocentric is different from yeah. Earth-centric. Um, there was a, I can't remember what the word is, but they actually have a word for it. Yep. Where we look at space from the point of view of... Earth being the center of life, the universe, and everything. But yeah, Douglas pretty much the process. last thing I do is the, the cleanup. Mm-hmm. That's that's the last, and after that, I could say, "Yep, yeah, this this show is done." But yeah. and all of the entire process we talk about, sometimes it the 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 mean I could finish that an entire afternoon, right? Depending on the internet speeds. I wonder now, like if because because I'd like to hear what our faithful fourteen listeners. Do with their post distro installs because I feel theirs are gonna be superior. <laughs> yeah, especially with like KDE. Yeah, <laughs> like with KDE with, with all of the infinite tweaking that you can do with KDE, like, which is amazing. <laughs> um, or like what you do with a window manager, for example. Yeah, because others well, really tweak those out, and sometimes like yeah, others well, also have do things with the organization of their folders and whatnot. Yeah. I mean, like say, but um, that's part of like what do you call this when you uh, partition. But that's part of the installation process. Yeah. yeah. So like, what do you do when you have uh, a fresh install of something that isn't Arch or Gentoo? <laughs> <laughs> because again, gas giants, gas giants. <laughs> Arch is Jupiter, Gentoo is Saturn. <laughs> We should put that on a quote you know, <laughs> that um, Arch and Gen 2 <laughs> where does the installation end and the customization <laughs> begin although but that that's a for me that's an entirely different type of fun as well yeah although I do have like the the, the point that like at least with Arch because I've never installed Gen 2 but with Arch you can you, you install the base system and that's it because yeah. you, you can use it off the bat right yeah you're, you have a, a little command line <laughs> And it's just there blinking. Then you have to put in. <laughs> yeah, then there's a command that you um, um, pack strap. Yeah. Uh, pack strap, and then like it, it pulls down all of the essential uh, files to get a working system. So like I think that's where the install ends. <laughs> but how about Antergos? With, with, um, with Antergos, you end up with you, you end up with a full uh, a fully functioning desktop. Oh yeah, pretty much. Uh, tell us uh, if you're a, except if you're a Gen two user or an Arch user, <laughs> or if you're a Gen two or Arch user, when does the, the install end and the customization begin? <laughs> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> because I'm not convinced that getting into a bootable system is the end of the installation process. <laughs> Or is it? I don't know. Yeah. Uh, dun, dun, dun. <laughs> <laughs> For that, uh, contact us at Channel 14. Uh, what's our Contact NSPM? the Channel 14. Yeah. Oh, or, or Linux at Channel 14.com. Yeah. Shit, keep up forgetting that we have that email address. <laughs> yeah. Linux at, at Channel 14.com. 14. <laughs> or if you want to just fucking forget about that, just head over to the website and use the contact form. Yeah. <laughs>